just tagging along in our own little spaceship. The sun is a thermonuclear fireball. Which way the wind 
pass through it. And then they went to the solar interstellar winds. And now they're adrift in interstellar deep space. of energy and boot of uh, protons and electrons. 
Fascinating to know that even though the sun is potentially the source of radiation that might kill us if we didn't have a protective sheath around our own planet, it's also the source of life and heat and energy that feeds the plants. enough, we might be just 
first.
external world that he discovered everything that we can touch, everything that matters is actually made up of atoms with these discrete outer layers of negative electrons and every time these atoms get bombarded with photo electric energy it causes the uh, the outermost shell
magnificent structures of the universe with it. A calm, clear summer night down in the Keys looking over the endless ocean, dark, dark ocean, reflecting the diamond study black velvet.
transcend ourselves in our past, using it to prop us up, stand on the shoulders of giants, and uh, become the spacefaring, Star Trekian type of benevolent, yet potent, maybe omnipotent eventually, beings in the universe, little centers of our own psychic cosmos. I think we could be the most profound thing there is, this experiment of this universe expanding, and then with inside it, multiple little universes, billions of universes, each existing on separate little planets, which in themselves are little islands in the cosmos, and inside your mind, your mind, is the potential to alter the course of humanity. Just remember that. structure that you've evolved from 